Art Lab has taken printing to a whole new level. Gone are the days of limitations with Art Lab's brand new textile printing. We at Expresso love the trend of ombre and we've decided to put out a challenge to the guys here and see if they can create an ombre surprise for us. Besides their popular wall art, this Cape Town-based digital printing lab recently imported new technology that allows them to print digitally directly onto cotton-based fabrics. Co-owner Craig White never walks away from a dare. This is an absolute wonderland. Tell me more about Art Lab and what the benefits are of digital textile printing. All right, Deneen, the Art Lab is a very special digital imaging facility. Believe it or not, we've been around for over 30 years in some or other form in digital graphics. And the Art Lab is the absolute cutting edge and pinnacle of everything that we've learned over that period. So we use the very latest technology, a bunch of very creative people, and we produce output that will just stun you. What are some of the hottest trends at the moment with textile printing? Well, the trends have developed from our general large format output. We specialize in custom decor applications. So we use technology to give you bespoke, personalized, custom output for all your residential commercial needs. The latest trend that we've dived into just last year is creative digital printing onto fabrics. So we're now producing the most stunning prints directly onto textiles for all those applications. Craig, we have a challenge for you. We absolutely love the trend of ombre at Espresso. Do you think you can recreate something similar to this for us? Certainly, Deneen. Um, let me just state up front that this is a very simple challenge for Art Lab with our latest technology. Our ombre by its nature is one colour veneting to another. Very expensive to produce using traditional techniques and difficult. So this will really be easy, bearing in mind that with digital we can print up to 17 million colours, any design of your imagination. And it costs as much as doing one simple colour. See, so, yep, this is an easy one. So I take it it's game on. It's game on. Craig has already created a graphic and now pulls it into the image processor that sends it to the printer in the size he requires. Wow, this is done. All done. Ready for steaming the next part of the process. Steaming? That sounds interesting. The reactive dyes are fixed to the fabric by steaming. During this step, the colours become even more intense and saturated than they appeared to be before. Thank you. Well, did they meet my challenge? They certainly did. It proves that there is no job too big or small for the creatives here at Art Lab. Well, hopefully that has got the creative juices flowing. You can do just about anything with ombre. If you want to get the really high-end stuff, you can go to the Art Lab. Beautiful, beautiful, um, unbelievable uh, tablecloth they've done. But as you can see from our very own ombre room, you can take it anywhere. This adds a great depth of feel. There's a beautiful feel in the room. And we've only essentially used one color in here. That's very, very true. And as you can see, ombre can be applied in many aspects of your life, from your walls to your table. How did you bring this all together? What was your inspiration? So the inspiration is keeping it simple, sticking with your one colour, which is our beautiful Dulux Azure Blue, and then playing with those colours and breaking it up with some really light tones, such as white and this beautiful charcoal, which is, where, which is the tablecloth that Art Lab has done for us. And, you know, as you can see, we've used now our beautiful table runner that we've just created. And I love the fact that the Hessian, with its holes, it lets some of the other colour come through. Exactly. You know, it's perfect topping. It breaks yeah. it up a little bit. Yeah, yeah. So sticking with it and using our bottles, as you can see, it doesn't have to be perfect. Things can be a little bit blotchy, a little bit messy, but it really comes together nicely when you look at it as a whole and see your blue being carried out in a few different ways. You know, sticking to a few elements, so I'll keep the blue again and do some blue cups or glass cups and cutting some extra fabric, which we ombre, to use as something to put on your plate to kind of break the solid white. So there's a few things you can do to play with it to make it come together. And this is relatively inexpensive, but it has a major wow factor. I can see this you know, romantic beachside exactly. um, dinner. This really does come together well. Um, and I love the fact that this is a theme that we see in our own studio used in so many creative ways. But Tana, thank, thank you so much. This has been an inspiring little session. I hope you guys at home thank have you. also picked up on a couple of tips. Now go and try it at home, but start with something small. Get yourself a nice piece of hessian. Start with a table dressing before you move on to one of your major walls.